Hello everybody, uh, my wife here. I thought I'd take this time out just to do a little bit of a vlog to promote yet another wonderful endeavour from Uncle Art Music and their studios. This time it's not for an album. It's actually, would you believe, for a documentary documenting the last thing I promoted, which was the Temple Shift album, as you all know. It's in an interesting little documentary, and this is done by Lucy Lowe, one of uh, David's uh, daughters. She's put a lot of time and effort into this, and she's now actually getting very, very close to completion. She's only needing now a couple of scenes actually to be recorded. She needs a few bits of extra uh, funding to actually cover a few little crossing the I's and dotting the T's with legal uh, reasons for getting it both on television or on screening and also getting it past certain classifications and also just to uh, finalise payments to uh, certain film locations and sets where they've actually uh, filmed some of the, uh, the footage for this documentary. The beauty about this documentary for those who are not completely informed is it's not just the history of Elite 2's theme music, although that's the big culmination that we see in the trailer that you've seen on previous video. It's also a small history of video game music as it was done in the days leading up to the Abbey Road Studios uh, sessions. And it's been somebody who was there at Abbey Road watching the orchestra, believe me, you are going to enjoy this thing. Trust me. It's over halfway funded now with over £5,000 uh, raised uh, with an £8,000 goal. So check it out. You know, Link's in the description. Go check it out. Yeah, Produced and directed by Lucy Lowe. Based on all the wonderful work that's done by David Lowe, otherwise known as Uncle Art. I can't say any more than that. If you're a big retro video gaming fan, and especially if you like retro video gaming music from the 80s and 90s, from the things like the ZX Spectrum, the Amstrad CPC 464, the Commodore 64, the Amiga, the Atari ST, the PC back in its DOS days when they had MT32 uh, MIDI units and stuff like that before, and you know, Gravis Ultrasound before all of the wonderful orchestral stuff that came out, you know, that we know and love today. This is something you might want to actually check out, folks. Like I say, they're halfway through their funding. £5,000 straight so far, 8000 to go at the time of this video. So check it out at the Kickstarter link. Catch you later, folks.